I would imagine if you asked all three, there's there's a similar theme. Um, I think the look. Anytime you don't sign a free agent, the proxy is usually money, right? The fair way to think about it. But there's no doubt when you when you look at the city of St. Louis, we've certainly got the black eye over the last few years, especially when you think about race relations. And you know, you, you mentioned three African American players, and, and I can assure you that they were very much aware of, of the environment. Now, subsequently, we have signed Dexter Fowler. Now. Is it a concern of mine that, that this is a topic that has to be addressed or, or at least spoken about? The answer is yes, absolutely. And you know, I think from the city as a whole, we should be worried about our image. And we certainly should be worried about what, what people think about us. And you know, in my industry, it's extremely competitive in terms of trying to attract talent. And I don't mean just this, you know, the one through nine that you see on the field. I'm talking about I recruit a lot of talent to work in our office and want to be here. And you know, I, I think our city as a whole needs to understand that we need a better job to improve our image. And uh, you know, it's not something that, that's easy for me to fix, but it's certainly something that I'm not afraid to talk about. And, and when you look at all these different dynamics that, that are happening, you know, having growth downtown will help. Having an infrastructure downtown will help. But when you're thinking about, you know, I remember when I was talking to Stanton and, and uh, um, I said, do you have any questions about St. Louis? He asked me about the high-rise high, high living in St. Louis. I started to laugh. Like, yeah, if that's really something you're interested in. That's a problem. And, uh, it's a building for story building overnight. And, uh, but, you know, but on a broader sense, I, I do think it's a concern for us overall. I mean, I don't think it's at the point where we're hitting the panic button because we're still a very desirable place to be. Um, you know, Matt Holliday, even though he's not with us, has been one of our biggest advocates just talking about this is a great place to play baseball. But, you know, I think the question isn't really about just playing baseball, it's about the environment as a whole or the culture as a whole. And so I think all of us need to be cognizant of that and, and be willing and open-minded to change.